Hey everybody, hope all is well. There is nothing, nothing is off limits. There's absolutely nothing that they will not ask of a black woman. No matter how they've treated you, disrespected you, that strong superwoman cape, that cape will, that cape will choke you. So here's an excerpt I'm gonna play. Um, I like you to listen to, and then so it's gonna have some music. So we may have to, yeah, just to be on the safe side, we'll do the part A. Well, I'm gonna play the excerpt, and then we're gonna go ahead and do the part B. So I'm gonna play this clip maybe uh, three minutes. This is the show Zatima, a kickoff, I believe, from Sisters. Of course, the wonderful Tyler Perry, I think, is very talented. How he writes these shows is unbelievable. Anyway, here's Atima. She's in a new relationship with Zach. So, I'm sorry, Fatima. And the show is called Zatima. She's in a new relationship with Zach. And so, that's her. Pretty girl. Over here is the ex-boyfriend. Dusty seems to just pop up. So listen to the conversation as they're having this meeting. Look, listen rather to what transpired. And I'd like you to listen in case you haven't seen it, what he asked of her. Check it out. Beautiful people, here we go. Mm-hmm. Sorry. It's okay. I didn't mean to spring this on you. It's fine, really. Here you are, trying to comfort me after all this shit. I just wish I was mad enough to say you're the right girl, but the wrong time. Instead, I played you. Yeah, you did. Fatima, I don't have nothing to lose now, so... I need to tell you why I ran. Does it even matter? I ran because... I was wondering what else was out there. I mean, you came along again. Mm -hmm. You were so damn perfect. But I figured if I settled down with you, then I wouldn't have been able to have fun, so I married her. Why? Her dad had money. Mm. Wow. I'm sorry. They set me up. I know that's fucked up. Yeah, it is. And I... You didn't even tell me the two of you were dating. I know. You said y'all had broken up. I know. But you were with her the whole time. I know. And I'm so sorry. And you got me pregnant. <laughs> and you talked me into an abortion. <sighs> Damn, Mom. I'm not finished. <laughs> and before I was even healed, <laughs> you came to me and told me it was over. <laughs> and you were going to marry her? Oh, no. so fucking stupid. Well, Fatima, this had nothing to do with you. You were enough. It was my dumb ass trying to fuck around and play games. Not being mad enough to see what I had right in front of me. Now I don't even have the time to fix it. So I'm here trying to just tell you everything, but and you know what? It's over. And I'm actually happy now. And I, I thank you for telling me this. Because I think it's actually going to help me heal and deal with the anger that I have. 
and help me to be a better person in the relationship that I'm in now. Is he good to you? He is. He better be. Better than you ever were. Yeah. I'm sorry, but it's true. Even when I was good. And even when you were good, he was always followed with some bullshit. Yeah, no. Look, I'm... I'm sorry that you're sick, Ian. I really am. And... You know, I, I loved you, and... I still got a lot of love for you. And I don't want to see you suffer. Or even see you in pain. I know your mom has to be devastated. She is. And she really wants to talk to you. Mm. Yeah, I, I can't do that. Why not? They yeah, were so close. Because, Ian, you and I are done. Fatima, do me a favor. I'm her only child. I just need you to be there for her when I'm gone. And lost her rabbit mind. Okay, y'all. That's what I want to get to. You saw part A. This is season one of episode five. Zatima. Okay. That's what, what I want to talk about. I need you to be there for me for her when I'm gone. So this is gonna be part A because they have the music playing and you know how it goes. Stick around, part B. Because we gotta have that commentary. Mm, mm, mm.